we saw the return of beautiful weather for our day yesterday. We saw plenty of sunshine. Temperatures up were just a little bit cooler in the 60s, but we should see things warming up a bit more today. And that's thanks to high pressure that just continues to build basically right over top of us. So pretty much keeping the East Coast, parts of the South and the Great Lakes clear for at least now. So expect beautiful weather before the high pressure starts to move on out. And we'll see these clouds likely start to roll in tomorrow. But still beautiful today, beautiful tomorrow. Really over the next couple of days, our best chance is going to come Sunday. And even that's just going to be a few morning showers. So today, tomorrow, great days to get outside. Even Monday as well. So Sunday, you'll just want to wait through the morning hours. But by the afternoon, evening hours, we should start to dry back out. And even that chance, we could see a few pockets of sunshine as well. But by Monday, though, we'll see temperatures get back to that summer like we're just about and below average today. And on Sunday, a very good chance we see temperatures get back into that mid to low 80s especially next week, but with warmer temperatures and sunshine, can't rule out that chance for a pop-up shower thunderstorm, especially Tuesday and Wednesday before our next system likely rolls through on Thursday. But as we start the morning, get that live look across the Fort Henry Bridge. Once again, just calm conditions, clear skies, but notice temperatures though, 43 here in Wheeling, definitely noticing things pretty chilly across the area. Have even noticed a few spots that have dipped into the 30s, like 39 up into Carrollton, and our cool spot of 37 in the Cambridge. So if you're stepping out the door, really first thing this morning, even before 8, 9 a.m., likely want to grab a jacket as you step out the door. But the good news, not going to need the jacket all day because by 8 a.m., we should see everyone back into the 50s. By 10 and 11, we should be in the 60s. And even by lunchtime, we'll start to flirt with the 70s before we max up somewhere between that 73 and 76 this afternoon. So cool spot, 73 here in Wheeling, but is warm possibly as that 76 up in Chester as well as into Caldwell. So most of us likely somewhere between 74 and 76, just minus our cool spot of 73 here in Wheeling. And even tomorrow, still going to know things beautiful. Not quite as much sunshine as today. Still going to see it throughout the day. We're going to see more of these upper level clouds start to roll on through. So instead of bright blue skies, it's going to be that more so whitish milky tint to the sky but still going to look and feel nice with everyone getting into the upper 70s. I even can't rule out a spot that might try to push into the low 80s as well. But come Sunday, that's when we'll see that chance for a few showers of turn. I expect most of that just to be for the morning hours with temperatures in the 70s, but can't rule out a few pockets of sunshine by the time we get to dinner time and by sunset. Monday though, temperatures try to get back into the 80s and we'll see the return of sunshine. So 80, mostly sunny on Monday. Even Tuesday into Wednesday, I expect more sunshine than cloud cover, but still going to be a mix of clouds and sun, but with warmer temperatures and high humidity, can't rule out that chance for a pop-up shower storm both Tuesday afternoon and Wednesday afternoon as well. Then 80 with a few spotty to scattered showers and thunderstorms for a day on Thursday.